little twit. I need it to help me figure out a way to bring Charity over to the dark side. Timmy won't let you hurt Charity. If you don't give me that page, you're going to be the one who's hurting. I'll lock you in a closet with Fluffy and leave you there until there's nothing left of little Tim Tim but a fur ball and a pair of white gloves. <laughs> Tim Tim, which is it going to be? Are you more afraid of Fluffy or me? <laughs> no exit, Tim Tim. The only way you're going to get out of here is to hand over that page. She's like a panther, isn't she? Stalking her prey. You don't want to be cat food, do you, Tim Tim? No, of course you don't. And you won't be if you hand over that page. Come on now, be a good lad. I have to work out the details of my plan. It has to work perfectly. Because if it doesn't, then Charity will slip out of my grasp and I won't be able to lure her over to the dark side. So come on, Timmy, let's have it. Page. It's wrong! What you're going to do to Charity is wrong! How many times have I told you there is no right or wrong? Just do as you're told! <sighs> think, tap the think. I know what'll get him out of there. Fluffy! I'll take that cat onto the roof and drop it down the chimney right on Timmy's head. Oh, no. No, it wouldn't be fair to scare Fluffy like that. What's Telfer doing now? There's a nip in the air tonight. Oh, a roaring fire will keep the chill away. Oh, I hope it doesn't get too hot for you, Tim Tim. <laughs> hope your clothes don't catch fire. <laughs> seen the light, have we? I don't blame you. If you can't stand the heat, get out of the chimney. Now, throw down the page and I will blow out the match. No! What? You're not getting the page. Timmy's not stupid. If you light that fire, not only are you going to burn up Timmy, but the page will be ashes too. Give me that page, Timmy! Checkmate. Princess. Tabitha, what are you doing? You'll soon see. Once I get the fireplace blocked, I'm going to go through with my original plan. That is to go up on the roof and drop Fluffy on your head. Timmy heard you say that would scare Fluffy too much to drop her. Well, Fluffy will get over it. But I'll give you one more chance before Fluffy comes screeching down the chimney at you. You hand over that page from the ancient tome and I'll forget the whole thing. Timmy will. Only if you promise that Charity won't get hurt. 
All right. Come along, Fluffy. You're going on a little trip. Okay, okay. Jimmy will give you the page. Jimmy only hopes that Jerry will forgive him for his weakness. No, oh, don't you worry about that, Tim Tim. All will be forgiven in the end. Oh. Dictionaries. Yes. Well, if you must know, this page was written in four languages. Latin, Greek, Aramaic, and a scene. I needed all these in order to decipher the message. What does it say? How are you going to lure charity to the dark side? Simple. She and Miguel have to be separated. And then the other girl will win, the one with the dark hair. Kay? Yes, yes, Kay will win. She'll get the boy. Kay's been trying for months to get Charity away from Miguel. And now they're closer than ever. Yes, I know. Just separating them isn't going to do it. But there's more here, if I can read my own writing. The best way to get Charity over to the dark side is for Miguel to die. And he must die by Charity's hand. Never say never, Tim Tim. Uh-oh. What are you thinking? I know a scenario where Charity would kill Miguel. As a matter of fact, it's a scenario that would work. I'm going to get Charity to kill Miguel today. <laughs> oh, Jimmy. <laughs> 